Hey, good morning. Today is December 14th, 2020. It's 11 a.m. And I want to share with you a new record regarding Gilbert, Arizona real estate. First of all, I want to just tell you about www.mls4gilbert.com. Again, www.mls4gilbert.com, your single best resource for looking for homes in Gilbert and the surrounding area. What's interesting, though, is the market is so crazy right now, this website's almost worthless. There's only 122 homes currently on the market in Gilbert. And there's a whole bunch of buttons on my website. Some of these buttons probably don't show that many homes. So, again, the best resource for looking for homes in Gilbert, Arizona, although there's only 122 homes total on the market. Let's jump over to the MLS really quick. I just did this search, and I actually did this search about an hour and a half ago. I was meeting with an agent, and there were 126 homes on the market. Now there's 122 homes on the market. I expected that to drop today because homes came off the market over the weekend. They actually sold, right? But the record I'm going to talk about, I'll talk about in a minute. But right now, the lowest priced home in all of Gilbert is actually extremely well priced compared to the rest of the market at $270,000 for 1,357 square feet. If I click on it, it looks like it came back on the market. So it's actually listed on uh, 1123. I think it went under contract and then it came back on the market, right? Oh yeah, so yeah, it came back on the market. So um, there was a tenant in place, $1,350 per month until March 21st. Plus, it looks like there's $2,500 allowance for carpet, paint, and other repairs. Okay, let's look at the highest priced home on the market. And it's the same as last week. It's this house right here. It's a uh, $2.195 million, 8,000 square foot home on almost an acre at Circle G. You can see from the photos, this is a pretty impressive house. And, uh, you know, usual. Let me know and I'll help you buy that home if that's what you want to do. But with 122 homes on the market, the median priced home, this is where we're breaking records. The median priced home will be home number 61. That means home number 61, there's 61 homes priced above this price and 61 homes below this price. And if I roll down here to home 61, the median asking price of all homes in Gilbert, Arizona today is $600,000. That means half the homes are priced less than $600,000 and half the price, half the homes are priced over $600,000. Like I said, I'm sharing this video today because that is a record. Let's bounce over here to my Gilbert, Arizona real-time market profile. And you can see that we are still in a strong seller's market. If this number was 30, that would be balanced. That means it wouldn't be a buyer's market, it wouldn't be a seller's market, it'd be right in the middle. Well, we are in 83 today. And I don't remember the actual highest it's ever been, but 83 is pretty high. If I look at the median list price here, list price here, this is over time. And the solid line is a 90-day moving average, and the broken line is a 7-day moving average. So even though this shows the 7-day moving average of $535,000, what's happening is the prices, the median prices have accelerated, and they're actually right up around here if it was a snapshot in time. So this is a 7-day moving average, and you can see it's being dragged down a little bit, but it is going to accelerate here rapidly. Next thing is price per square foot. I like to look at price per square foot. And this is over the last three years. You can see we're about 150 bucks a square foot about three years ago. Today, the seven day moving average is $210 a square foot. That means half the homes are priced above $210 a square foot. Half the homes are priced below $210 a square foot. Typically, typically smaller homes will be priced higher per square foot, 
Larger homes would be priced less per square foot. It costs less to build a bigger home when you factor in land and all that kind of stuff. But you hit luxury homes and then the luxury home price per square foot then accelerates across all home sizes. Okay, hope that makes sense. If it doesn't, I can meet with you and discuss this with you, right? So now I also love to look at inventory. And this only goes back three years. I wish this chart went back a little further because we averaged about a thousand homes on the market in Gilbert, Arizona. You can see we even had 800, almost 900 homes just a year and a half ago. And we have done nothing but drop. This is a little, I call this the little COVID hiccup, meaning we were on our way down here to you know, 200 homes on the market and then COVID happened. We shot back up to 400 and that didn't last long. And look at, I thought we were gonna stabilize right around here, two to 300 and boy was I wrong because this shows 156 homes as the moving average. But as we go back to the MLS directly, we can see that there's just 122 single family detached homes in the whole city of Gilbert, Arizona. Let's go back, refresh your memory, www.mls4gilbert.com. This is where you can search all homes. Let me just click on one, for example. Let's look at Gilbert Just Listed Homes. This is a category anybody that's interested in buying a home would be interested in. Click the button, give it a couple seconds to load up. A map opens, and here are 44 just listed homes. I can sort price highest to lowest, and I can see that the highest priced is 1.3 million, which is obviously much more of land than the house. It's a 2,200 square foot house on a huge piece of property. We've got a 1.375, a 1.325, a 1.1, so we have five just listed homes over a million dollars. We can go all the way down to the bottom and we can see, is this multiple? I'll go, go to page two. And we can see this one right here, just listed $340,000, 345. Uh, some nice looking homes here. So that's one thing you can do at www.mls4gilbert.com. You can find and see just listed homes plus all these other categories. Scroll down a little bit, and you have the option to find out the value of your Gilbert home. Click right there. Looks like I have a link to fix, and I'll have that fixed before you get there, okay? So that's where you can actually request the value of your home if you're curious what your home might be worth. We can talk to you about what we can do to help you sell it for top dollar, even in this crazy market. Again, my name is David Dion. My phone number is 480-332-5942. You can always find me, contact me at mls4gilbert.com or www.daviddion.com. Take care. Have a great day.